Good morning. Good morning. And welcome to another vlog. Today we go going swimming and the beach. Yeah, so it's day two of our holiday. So like Edison says, we're going swimming at 10 o'clock this morning. So we've got a time slot booked for then. It's swimming and a beach today. It is, yeah. But first we're going to go to the too. beach because it's still only like quarter past half seven or something like that like I say swim is not till 10 it's so we're actually going to drive to like um Tembe um sort of town center and there's like a car park that's right next to the beach and we're going to go to that one and just play on the beach for well probably around an hour if Emma lasts that long but we'll see obviously you saw them buying their buckets and spades yesterday so we're going to take those with us and hopefully make some sandcastles maybe have a little splash in the water and throw some stones Playing rock pools, I don't know. We'll um, see how the morning goes anyway. So, um, we'll see you when we get there. And um, um, throw the stones in the water. Okay. Oh, joy. <laughs> so we've parked up in the car park that's right by the beach. It was a very sunny morning. It's only eight o'clock. Car parking charges apply from nine o'clock. It's only like a pain for an hour anyway. So uh, <laughs> if we stay here longer than nine o'clock, we can quickly run up and pop a main in. But if we take a look, it's absolutely gorgeous here. <laughs> Edison, are you excited to play on the beach? I'm, yeah. Are you? I am, yeah. Wow, look at this. All this sand. <laughs> look at him go. Whee! <laughs> and here we are on the beautiful beach of Tembe. It's so nice here. It's such a nice morning. <laughs> Sun's up. You can see this. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but there's lots of uh, surfers there. Some of them are going back to their cars and stuff. They finished for the morning. What a beautiful morning it is. What a beautiful beach. To spend with the kids on holiday. <laughs> Edison's made a start on his sandcastle. Good job. Wow, look at those waves, bloody hell. No wonder all the surfers are out this morning. Some huge wave crashes. Wow! Scoop! Yeah, you're doing really well, mister. Good job! Oh, and if you take a look, Edison's done his sandcastle. <laughs> Emma's just had a go, she just piled, poured a pile all over herself. Edison's planting his stick on her flag. Yay. Yeah, good job. <laughs> Fantastic sandcastle, Edison. Yeah. Good job. <laughs> it was fantastic. Yeah, we could go over there if you like, yeah. Let's knock it off. Knock it over, isn't it? Over. Okay. Well, Mummy and Edison have gone down to the water's edge and he absolutely loves it. You think he's going to be throwing some stones in, probably. Oh, there he goes. Hey, good job. Got 17 times zoom on here, so... <laughs> yeah, good jump, Edison. <laughs> on his bum. I think he's got his waterproof, so he'd probably be alright. <laughs> Uh, hopefully mummy doesn't get wet because her wellies have got a hole in them. Such a nice morning here though, it's absolutely gorgeous. Stunning. This one wants my help, dude, because we built a sandcastle here together, didn't we, in your bucket? So you want help filling this one and making another one, is it? Yeah, man. in. I know I've said this several times already, but it's such a nice beach, this one. So beautiful. Like I say, it's such a nice morning as well. With the be nice dry, no wind, no rain. I mean, even though it's not windy, look how big the waves are. Maybe it's a bit windy further out, but uh, my turn with Edison to throw some stones in. See what we can do.
The waves just keep getting bigger and bigger and closer. Okay, just get me for you. It's okay, you can stay there. Eddie, another one's coming. Uh oh, that's it. You're okay though. Like really foamy, isn't it? It was a big one. Yeah, just gotta be careful on me. We don't want to get soaked, but so you do have your boots and your waterproofs on, so. It's coming now. Good job. Maybe the tide's going out. No, because it's not coming in as far. Why? I don't know. Should we take a few steps forward? Do you want to get your wellies wet, do you? Okay, bye then. That's okay. <laughs> Did it go is it gone inside your wellies? Are your feet wet? Are they okay? <laughs> we just <laughs> took sea over this. Is that Coney Island, I think? Yeah, where you've got the uh, islands just off Tempe. Looks lovely. And obviously, you've got all the uh, river, well, the seafront houses there. I was going to say riverfront there, but obviously, it's the sea. <laughs> Such a nice beach. Let's go up and play with the girls anyway. And the girls have joined us. Yay! You having fun, Emma? Yeah. <laughs> I think she's gonna love us too. She normally loves checking stones in the rivers and stuff, doesn't she? So, <laughs> yay! yay. <laughs> <laughs> Brushing it off. <laughs> Good throw, Edison. Ah. Is it coming, Emma? Ah. Away. <laughs> you silly girl. Uh oh, is it? Yeah. And to finish off the morning, just a bit of sandcastle making again. <laughs> See, there's more surfers just come and uh, go to enjoy the nice waves that are out there. Yeah, we're going to enjoy this for another sort of 15, 20 minutes because it's 20 to 9 now. Um, we're probably going to head off at 9, so we can go back, get our swimming costumes on, and uh, go swimming then. <laughs> Edison's having a go at writing his name in the scent. Good job, Miss. Uh, it's very hard, isn't it? Oh, N. Good job. It's difficult, isn't it, to write in the scent? But that's a good effort. There we go. I've wrote his name in the sand for him. <laughs> that's per his request. And we're back in the caravans. That was a really fun time at the beach. The kids actually really enjoyed themselves, Emma especially. I was saying to Mummy, she actually really enjoyed it at the beach, just building sandcastles constantly. And she loved it a bit by the water's edge, but not as much as Edson. He prefers like the water and stuff, but he did enjoy building sandcastles too. But Emma was loving it, playing in the sand. That was a nice fun hour or more there. As you can tell, they were in their costumes ready because it's 20 past nine. What are we going to get in hours now? I think Mummy's already got hers on actually under her clothes. I'm going to put mine on now and then we're going to go swimming at 10 a.m. But obviously, I don't think we can film when we're in the pool, so I'll pick this up when we're out in the pool. One hour later. And we're back in the caravan, so that was a really fun time swimming. We had an absolutely fantastic time. The kids loved it, um, especially Emma. She just went down the slide like a million times. She was able to go on it because um, it says that you can go on the slide as long as you can walk up the steps unaided. I mean, they are pretty big steps, so although Emma can walk up them, uh, we were still like holding her hands to help her walk up, but that was fine. Um, you do have to sit on the slide by yourself, so there's two like slides side by slide, uh, two slides side by side, and um, you have to go down, you know, one on each side. You can't like have any children on your lap or anything like that. But that was fine. Emma went down fine by herself. 
Um, and the pool itself is so warm, it's literally like lukewarm bath, like a lukewarm bath temperature. Um, so yeah, it was absolutely brilliant. Um, the kids had such a great time there and uh, we stuck to our hour slot because yeah, they did sort of say, because um, we did book on at 10 o'clock um, and they said, you give you a band, so ours was a red band, they said. Um, so you get one hour um, to finish at 11 but I didn't hear any sort of lifeguards or any pool announcements or anything sort of calling for band colours or anything to get out so I don't know how strict they are on that if you stay in maybe it depends on how busy the pool is or how busy it's getting but um, yeah we had a great great hour there anyway so you can see here we just got the remnants of our lunch we just had some beans on toast and stuff just chilling out Edison's having oh well reading some with his book, and uh, they both had a squishy, haven't you? Ah, you got a frog squishy, haven't you? Ow! <laughs> we beat the camera. And Emma's got a panda squishy, so we did stop by the shop on the way back to pick up a few things, and they got a squishy because Nanny gave him some money. But yeah, I'm just sort of tidying up now, probably just do the dishes, things like that, and then we're gonna head out, I think, to Saunders Foot. Head to the beach here, have a look at some of the shops, or we'll see you when we get to Saundersfoot. And we have arrived at Saundersfoot. <laughs> so, packed in the harbour car park. There's another beautiful beach. Nice day, looks like the tide's going out, because sometimes it comes quite far up, sort of, where the water line is there and stuff. But, uh, yep, if you take a look, let's see through the dark glass there. The little one's falling asleep, bless her. So, she's falling asleep on the way here, so, uh, yeah, just I'm gonna chill out here and sit in the car or just sit by here waiting for her to wake up. And Mummy and Edison gone to the shops over there to do a bit of shopping, maybe get an ice cream from uh, the shops over there. Although we did see a Sub Zero over there. in the corner, they see a Sub Zero ice cream over there, which is what we get when we're home. So, yep, chill out, chill out here for a few hours. Such a nice day again to come on the beach. I can see the waves out there, but uh, if you did some surfing, they'd be pretty good ones as well to uh, <laughs> to go on. Yeah, they're doing a lot of work right there. They've got a big um, ship over there. You know what that is. And also they're doing lots of construction work on the harbour front as well. Like, I mean, that building's fairly new all the way over there. Yeah, see all shops and stuff over like all these sort of shops here and new and stuff they've been over here like the last two or three years i think so yeah getting busier getting busier but still just as nice mm, so mummy's come back with edison i treated us all to an ice cream you know you've got waffle cone ones edison's got a standard cone and it's like a strawberry really nice. I mean, he's got for salted caramel, which is nice too, but no, last time he came, he was in one of those wooden huts, sort of, over by there, called gelatos, but where were they from this time? Yeah, there's just a shop over there somewhere, but very nice. I mean, I just enjoy an ice cream on the seafront. <laughs> it's, nice, it's a nice day to look out and watch it. It's such a big ice cream as well, it's like massive. Hot buried with ice cream, was it? A choice. So we made it onto the beach. We did wake Emma up um, so that she does have a sleep tonight. So she had about 45 minutes or more in the car. But if we look down, you can see these are little tiny footprints and they're, <laughs> they're from Edison's feet. So as soon as we came down onto the beach, he was like, can I take my shoes and socks off so I can run round? And uh, well, yeah, go for it. So he's got his shoes and socks off. Probably getting cold feet because it's not the warmest of days, but it's a nice... Of course you can. It's a nice and soft, the sand, Edison. Yeah. It's nice on your feet, on your toes. Uh, I don't think this is going to be good sand for sandcastles. So go a bit further up my mummy and then we'll start making some. <laughs> so fill my bucket, Edison's still going with his. Let's turn him over, Edison, is it? Oh. Ah. I have to. So tap, you tap it then. Do you want to lift him up for me or do you want me to do it? I want to do it. Well, let's see if it lasts you when it's good sand. <laughs> yeah, good job. Thank you, mister. Uh, let's do another one. Carry on with your one. Ah, oh, break it down straight away, is it? Do another one. <laughs> Emma, bless her, she's still just feeling under the weather and just wanted a bit of TLC from Mummy. Let's have a look, Henderson, he's finished building his castle. 
He's giving a good pat. Is he going to be successful? Uh -oh, slowly, that's it. Hey, good job, mister. <laughs> oh, of course he wants to go in the water. It's like a little, I don't know, stream out there. I don't know whether that's sewer water or there's just bloody, you know, water from like the drains or something. But <laughs> flowing into the sea, but yeah, he wants to walk in it. So roll his trousers up <laughs> and bare feet walking. Off he goes. <laughs> And of course, after really saying that uh, <laughs> probably won't be going in the water to him, we've ended up at the water's edge. So without any wellies on, <laughs> we've rolled up his trousers. And I must admit, I'm not going to keep him here long, because it is freezing, it's like a wind blowing. Like, it's quite blustery. And yeah, it's, uh, it's a bit cold, so... so let him have a little paddle, yeah? Then head... <laughs> Is it cold? Yeah! Right, go slowly because you'll get yourself soaking in cold nights. Are you running away from it? <laughs> Such big waves again. Like I said earlier, it'd be a nice place for us, you know, if you were a surfer, I guess, to come and ride some of the waves. <laughs> we picked up some of these double shells on the way that he wants to keep. I think I've got two, so. <laughs> he loves it a lot, bless him. <laughs> There's another one coming, is there? Ah, oh, and another one after that as well. Way! Oh, so that was a short lived uh, shower, but. It's really blustery day, day by the waterfront there, it's really blustery, it's really cold, so I'm back up here now, Emma's not feeling very well, she's still just having a hug and a sleep with mummy, just under the weather, like coughing and stuff, so I'll let her just have like five, ten more minutes here, just playing, and then uh, head back in the car and head home, I think, well, back to the caravan at least. Oh, he's been playing a game of like climbing across the rocks to, uh, <laughs> like falling in. He's doing really well, he's been back and forward like four times now. Or five times, this will be the sixth. Oh, that's it. <laughs> Good job. Is he gonna make it? Oh, oh there's a foot in the water then. <laughs> yeah, good job. Come on, let's go back to the car, back to the caravan. Uh, we're back in the caravan. That was a nice fun uh, 19 minutes or so at Saunders Foot. To say Emma, bless her, she's just really poorly. Just giving her some cow paw now though to perk her up a bit. She said ibuprofen earlier. Watching a bit of uh, rubbish on Mummy's phone, aren't you? How you, fe how you feeling? Nicky. You're watching Nicky, is it? Holding a squishy and drinking a fruit shoot, having a nice holiday. Yeah. yeah. It's about half three now, we're just going to chill out for a bit and, um, well, have an hour or more rest um, in the caravan and then have tea. Uh, probably just going to have pizza tonight. We did buy some from Sainsbury's uh, before we we'll see how the kids are, see how Emma's feeling. Maybe we'll head out to the entertainment complex again tonight because it was really good last night. The kids enjoyed it, we enjoyed it. But, um, like I say, with the kids being ill, We'll just see how it goes, yeah, we'll just see how it goes, so... Yep, picking something, we're doing something interesting. Two hours later. Whoa, Emma, look at your pretty dress. And you look pretty, ready to dance the night away. And you, Edison, let's have a look how handsome you are. So we're ready to go dancing, aren't we? Are you going dancing? Yeah. Yeah, it's your pretty dress, isn't it? Yeah. Go a bag as well. <laughs> Ready to go, anyways. I'm gonna try and get the cab, park a bit closer today, and, uh, and then drive back. So we are fortunate, we got a space just just behind this car right in the corner there. And we're here, ready to dance the night away. <laughs> Let's get inside anyway, see what tonight's all about. And straight away, they're dancing on the stage. Emma was just dancing, but she stopped to watch like a baby or something for now. <laughs>
that. So Edison sort of got a bit upset because the girl didn't want to hold hands when um, they were dancing, doing the hokey cokey. So he sat out for a while. Emma did a bit of dancing, but then she got a bit upset too. So now we're downstairs after 45 minutes to about 45, 50 minutes to uh, play in the arcade for a little bit, spend a few pounds before heading back to the caravan. Wow! Yay! Yay! Have fun! Woo! Woo! Look where Emma's got you! Emma's won two teddies! Thank you, Gaga! We just went on there, it's got 107 score. Good job! Just realised that I forgot to do an eight trophy yesterday. So yeah, we just had a quick play in the arcade before just coming home, getting ready for bed and going to sleep. So I'm gonna leave the vlog there. So with that, hope you enjoyed. Open and shine. Very good.